part two to my two-part series on how to achieve flawless skincare and makeup while trying to navigate having combination skin. Let's go. As you probably saw in my part one, I do cover how you can use SPF as a primer. I know right? If you don't want to use an SPF, because I know some of y'all are a little stubborn, what I recommend to my clients is the Shine Control by Makeup Forever. It is amazing. There's also the Pore Minimizer by Makeup Forever. What I've noticed is that the Shine Control also minimizes those pores. It's actually amazing. So it's a two-in-one. Not only does it Shine Control, but it also minimizes your pores. And I put this in my T-zone. And it mattifies you, but it hydrates you. So it doesn't make it look like bad leather. So it looks like it's, it's healthy skin. As far as foundation is concerned, I use to love my face being completely matte but it just I just felt that it made me look so dull and very dry I was like this is not good so what I discovered is I really like to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills luminous foundation which is mattifying and then I mix this with the save foundation which is 70% water full of antioxidants super hydrating I can't wear these two on their own this one's too mattifying this one is too hydrating I mix these two together and it's such a great marriage it makes my skin look like this which i really love and then to set everything i use the super matte loose powder by makeup forever i absolutely love this powder i just do it in my t-zone with a big fluffy brush and on my jawline for no transfer on the jawline this is amazing i'm literally mattified all day i leave my loose powders at home because i always have this fear that they're gonna explode in my bag. Along with me, I like to take my favorite, the HD Skin Matte Velvet Powder Foundation. I absolutely love this thing. Well, I hardly use it when I bring it with me because I'm mattified all day. I don't get oily at all. I only use it if it's really hot out, which is really rare that I get oily, but this I take with me because it's so much easier to carry. Highly recommend it. There's this new technique that is called the cloud setting, which is supposed to be fluffy and light. So you only put it in your T-zone and on the jawline and then everything else, you just leave it and it's supposed to just look like skin and it's not supposed to be like caked on, which I absolutely love. I've been doing this for a while and it has an actual name. So it's the cloud setting technique. Uh, for applying powder on your face. I go in and set my makeup. There's two of my top favorites right now. So there's a Sephora makeup setting spray. This one has the 16 hour wear and is transfer proof, humidity proof. It has ginseng. So if you have any like sort of like reaction or something to the skin just, just tames it. And then also the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray by Charlotte Tilbury. I absolutely love it. It just makes it look like glowy and bougie and nice, just like it is now. I'm wearing it right now. But again, for all my stubborn ones out there that do not want the glowy look, I understand you. That's totally fine. But you want the mattifying look and you want your makeup to stay. You know what I'm going to say? One size Patrick Star, the Until Dawn. You know I did the testing on it. It was on for like 19 hours. It did not move. It's blurring and mattifying. It's absolutely lovely. I absolutely love it. But just in case the one size is sold out, because most of the time it is a Sephora, because I talk about it a lot and I like to think that people actually listen to me. And so it sold out. If you cannot find the one size, I do recommend the Milk Mattifying and Blurring Setting Spray. It has the same reviews as the one size online. People love it just as much as well as the one size and the milk they both have two sizes a regular size and a travel size again i'm all about the travel sizes thank you so much for watching and i hope this has helped you with your combination venture let me know in the comments below how it's been helping you any reviews any feedback let me know love you lots bye